Hey, we're here at Telco TV and the floor is buzzing, so we decided to take a look around, talk to some people, and find out what they think is new and exciting this year. The most interesting product I saw was uh, from Minerva. They've got a, a lot of innovation in their products using the Intone set-top boxes and, and their middleware, getting onto cable plants and IPTV and allowing operators to, you know, say a telco that has HFC plant to sh give the same experience to customers in both sides of their distribution. You know, so to me, that was the most innovative product. Uh, the most exciting thing I've seen is really the integration of several vendors. Uh, for example, we resell Minerva's product. So the fact that all the vendors around here is easy for us to talk about, talk to them, and how do we can integrate the solution for our customers. So that's the most exciting thing I've seen. The, the new companies that are, they're in, um, B I think BGNS, uh, BNS or whatever, down, down the street, the new companies are, com are becoming more and more uh, prevalent in shows like Telco TV. And that's what we came here to see. This Edgeware stuff looks pretty cool. I've actually been waiting in line to try to talk to them, but um, just the way they're kind of delivering the video looks pretty new, pretty cool. Well, they definitely have like a nightclub vibe. Yeah, I don't know how much is the presentation versus the product, but the presentation's pretty good. It's all exciting because I have a cable TV uh, or a cable plant that is very, very old and needs upgrading. So everything here is exciting to me. I need, I need gear, I need content, I need everything. So, so basically everything on here you need. Uh, pretty much everything here I need, and if I ever get around to my fiber optic uh, deployment in California, uh, there's even more stuff here that I need. So, yeah. Now, anything, if you had to, like, rate it, you know, if you had an agenda, like, hey, I got to do, you know, the A number one thing, what is it? What are you looking for here? Uh, upgrading the cable plan itself. I, I actually, I literally have to take an old analog system and t convert it to digital and put internet on it. Uh, it's, it's, it's almost like putting in a whole new cable system. Well, one of the things I've found is, is that we work with a lot of tier three service providers and they're looking for a startup solution and uh, Harmonic Lightwave now has a streaming box that is, they're working with ETEX and they're beginning to do some middleware innovation uh, for a small operator just trying to get into this business. Very new technologies, uh, for example, over-the-top types of technologies, a lot of things associated with IPTV uh, types of technologies uh, that from a telco uh, standpoint are very exciting uh, to them. I, I think these are things that, that the, the customers are looking for. Yeah, so, so that would be a, a thing that would be of a lot of interest to them. Um, one of the things that's been really exciting for me is the um, other wireless options on the set-top boxes because that's been an issue in our market. We can't always hardwire, and some of the other wireless solutions have not been there, so there's some now wireless dongles and things available on some of the boxes themselves. That's probably the biggest right now. Uh, we've started looking at more of the IPTV stuff, that there's a lot of vendors here talking about the different technologies that they can help us look at the IPTV from set-top box to analyzing it and looking at those parts. Well, I think some new vendors. I mean, literally, I just have gotten on the floor, Jeff, so I haven't been here long, but just the fact that you've got new vendors, I noticed something Frontier Secure. I'm not certain what that's about. I want to check that out. Uh, and a lot of activity, just the fact that you've got so many people in one spot um, says a lot. And I think Shirley Bloomfield's comments today about Telco Vision, the fact that it's moving from Telco TV to Telco Vision, I think uh, the little I've seen on the floor kind of points to that direction.